find any given day on QVC. But when we have the kickoff of Christmas in July and everything's on sale, um, Amazing. we honestly didn't even have to think, David, because we knew with you coming here, David, oh, the CEO. You are this no, one. I, mean it. I love you. Mm, I love you right back. And you look you. gorgeous tonight. Yeah, I, I dress for you. To I'm like, I'm going to dress up. Oh, you look we've great. got the what Joan Rivers ornaments here. They're unbelievable. First time ever being seen in 2017. Already 300 of you did not wait, so please don't wait. And they you told me what amazing. we have in our building to ship out right now is all anybody's going to get. We did the entire limited edition and we shipped it in now. So my uh, my fear is we're going to come around to the Christmas time and you're going to start thinking about decorating your tree and we won't have them for you. So my advice is, well, take advantage of the crazy sale price yes. that you guys are doing, but really think about putting this back into your collection right now. We're looking at four hand-painted, hand-embellished, hand-blown glass ornaments. These are Amazing. I mean, work like this doesn't happen anymore. No. I think mm -hmm. it's extraordinary. That particular egg we're looking at is the cl Imperial Clover egg. All of them are inspired by the Fabergé Imperial eggs. And as you, as you know, Joan right. loved but things tell us Russian. But Jones is yeah. new to Cuba. Sure. If you're not familiar with, with why Joan and I had this passion for Fabergé, we took several trips to St. Petersburg. Wow. Joan collected Fabergé. She was really one of the big collectors in the world mm -hmm. of, of objects and uh, jewelry and and or you know things that Fabergé Objet that Fabergé made and her collection was exhibited in museums around the world yes. next to the Forbes collection next to the Hermitage Museum's collection at the Metropolitan Museum of Art in New York City so she loved this world more important she knew this world mm -hmm. we went to the Hermitage guests of the Hermitage we were brought back into the storage rooms and Jane we were handed objects to literally hold they make you put the little white gloves right. on and you hold the objects that Fabergé and his craft been made 100, 125 years ago. Wow. Extraordinary. So we're That's very, through, right? we approach them in a very almost sort of scientific way. We want them to be as beautiful and authentic. This is the St. Petersburg egg. It's a very famous egg in the style of Louis XV. Mm -hmm. It is at the Hermitage. You can actually, if you're at the Hermitage, a woman just went to my Facebook page and said, here are pictures I took of the Fabergé in Russia. She was oh there last gosh. year. So you can actually see them. They're behind glass. And it's a big trip to go to Russia, mm -hmm. of course. But this egg actually resides in the Hermitage. And I will add that the actual imperial egg, the St. Petersburg egg, is about that size. Oh, my gosh. People always think they're very big and very right. elaborate. They're basically two to three, three and a half inches. So imperial. The next one is I'm blown away oh by the gosh. craftsmanship. Oh, my gosh. Well, my here. Irish friends who are here today, oh, I my know goodness. they're buying this Oh, set. my goodness, of course. This was the imperial clover <gasps> egg. And if you're, well, you see we've done in that little sparkly silver and we've done a little red enamel that would have been rubies woven through the clover and then all of the what you see as the silver clovers were actually handset diamonds. Oh my this gosh. original egg was done in, in um, Plique a jour, mm -hmm. which is basically transparent enamel. It is the most intricate of all of the Fabergé eggs. I love the the, uh, the Romanov egg. Now, Fabergé was the jeweler to the Romanov, you know, mm -hmm. dynasty. Uh, the last czar when they had the revolution and he, he was the jeweler to Tsar Nicholas. He was the jeweler making the imperial eggs that he gave to his wife Alexandra, that he gave to his mother, the, the Dowager Empress of, Dan of the Denmark. And Fabergé made 46 of these imperial eggs for the Tsar as gifts to his family until, of course, when the revolution happened and there were no more eggs. <laughs> I'm, can, can, I'm so glad you just said that. Mm. There are no more eggs. We have 2,500 sets ah! for the 2017 season. Oh, dear. Oh, dear. Oh, dear. We have 2,500 oh sets well, for the 2017 season. This is the only order of the year. I mean, maybe even if it sells out tonight or it sells out tomorrow, this is the only order oh, of the year. Look at that. I mean, when you gift these every single season, they are going to be devastated if they do not get the 2017 I, I, set. I hear from women on my Facebook page. Please let me know when they're coming. I have every. How about I have every set of eggs you've done since 2004 when oh, we started my them? Goodness. Now, what I do is I keep them in this gorgeous satin box, and I'll, I do something that Joan taught me, which is on the end, I'll write 2017 in oh, magic marker, great, great. which is just, you can do it on the bottom if you right. want to keep it looking nice. But And then when I take them off my tree, I put them back in the original box as they come right. in. So my dining room table is a sea of red boxes <laughs> come, come Thanksgiving Your tree, time. I mean, <laughs> follow David on Instagram. Oh, when that fun. tree gets put together, it it's, takes your breath it's away. It's pretty wild. Well, you've now, seen my house at Christmas. Oh I go gosh, crazy. It's I go nuts. Now, can we take a look the, at this the last one? The final one? egg is, the, is actually the Hermitage egg, and this is Fabergé really saluting what's called the pan-Slavic style. And that would be 
he had two customers, the Moscow customer and the St. Petersburg customer. St. Petersburg customer loved the idea of uh, the French influence, the Rococo, mm -hmm. the Baroque. The Moscow customer loved the celebration of Russian style art. So what you're seeing here would be an egg that was done in cloisonne and beautiful enamel, of course on platinum and on gold mm -hmm. and on precious diamonds. And that egg um, would have been a, kind of an uh, in honor of the more country style of the Russian eggs. By the way, I'm putting up on Facebook, I'm on JoanRivers.com actually, right. a complete description and a little write-up that I've done on every egg. Oh, thank you. So, so you'll, if you want to go in and really get a little bit more knowledge, right. um, JoanRivers.com, and you'll see that we're mounting it right there. Well, we partnered with <clears> David <throat> because, like we said, there are fewer now than 2,500 to go around for 2017. They cannot be made again. Nope. These molds are broken. They're handmade. Right. They are hand-painted. They won't be made again this year. And this, I mean, the you know, and you're not paying extra for the box, for goodness sake. It's the only order of the year. Look at all our trees. It's so beautiful. Oh, isn't so that pretty? So at $72, oh. at a around you know an amazing price like if this was a hundred dollars a QVC at twenty five dollars an egg I'd say yes well if, if I were shopping at Saks Fifth Avenue oh, if I were shopping at Neiman's <laughs> these would be they have no trouble saying those are a hundred dollars right. and, and they're, like, okay. they're very much in the style of what we're doing and they're of course glass and they're hand painted but they have no trouble looking in the eye and saying that's hundred and sixteen dollars sir and you're like wait a minute yeah. so I love that we do this for we've done this now since 2004 we do it with such love I now do it through Joan's eyes through right. Joan's perspective uh, she was a great educator. She taught me so much about Russian history and Russian art. She had a house filled, as you know, with beautiful Russian furniture. So we look at these now really through the, the prism of Joan's yeah. sort of love of right. that. And they're a joy to make. And as you mentioned, we only make so many. Right. It's a limited edition. 2,200 left to go around for the year. They're amazing. David cannot bring any more in. And I hate even to be the mundane and say, look at that price, but I kind of have to because they're on sale. Well, I mean, these listen. These don't go I mean, on sale. They're no, $58.90. No, no, no. I Which mean, I have amazing. a special family member that I give them to every single season, and I know she would be so disappointed if she did not get them but Absolutely. I was thinking why don't you get two sets because mm. they're on four easy payments of $14.73 <clears throat> okay so there is no way anywhere that any of these eggs would be sold for $14.73. Never. But that's exactly the what the price is. So get a set for you to keep a treasure for mm. the new baby, for the new home, for the new bride and groom, just because. But then I would get a second set. And if you want to give a gift that looks like you spent a lot of money mm. and you only spent under $15, then you could gift these individually. I, I love that. Well, my, I do a big open house every year. And what I did this last, last year was I did little gift bags as people were leaving. And I put two of these in with some gold tissue. Wow. I can't tell you. I mean, I throw parties all the time. Everybody loves it. I've never seen feedback like that in my life. People were calling me the next morning and saying, I got home and I opened up the bag and what, uh, what was going yeah, on in there? Right. They're amazing. And you are going to give these, you're going to pass these down to your kids and your yes. grandkids. I look at my Christmas tree and it's 12 feet tall. It's loaded with ornaments. The star of my tree is really the, the ornaments that my mom left me. Yeah. The ornaments that I remember on my grandmother's tree. Ornaments that that are now 15, 14, 15 years old that Joan and I made, and those are the stars. Right. Those are, and I yeah. fill it in with lots of other fun, wonderful stuff. But when you really look at your tree, it's a, it's a, it's a memory. It is. It, it really is, is it's about your child the memory. Come to life again. Absolutely. So fewer than two thousand sets to go around for the entire year. They will not be remade again. And David, we, and we have a few minutes left. Again, mm -hmm. sale price not lasting forever. Amazing. We have four easy payments of fourteen seventy three. If you have a cue card, you could put it on five easy payments. But will you take us through sure. all brand new? These <clears> have never been repeated we all, all we never repeat an egg we do four new we do an, an addition once a year guys so that's it you're not going to see once these are gone we won't have another four that we're going to bring in in November yeah. this will be it and as you mentioned the molds are broken the the patterns are destroyed and keep in mind when you're looking at the paint and the detail and the enamel these are handmade there's mm -hmm. no uh, machine that, that puts this surface on there so the very first egg is the St. Petersburg egg and what I love about that is that matte finish it's not a shiny red. It's a it's a sort of a beautiful dull matte finish. I love that sort of table cut diamond set in the center. And by the way, all the way around, there's yeah. no bad side, mm -hmm. good side. And I will show you the hallmark. If the camera can come in and show you right here, it's a little hard to see. It's small, but oh, it'll say JR yeah. 2017. <gasps> so every year is hallmarked. That's how oh, I know that. which which boxes Wait, to put them so back in. Everybody needs to run. Who has a new baby? Who has a new Oh, home? for the year. Who has oh, that's a, new a puppy? graduation new puppy. Graduation. That's me. Yep, new to house. celebrate the year oh that's lovely gosh. that's lovely treasure forever the the green egg is the imperial clover as you can see it's all over beautiful 
look at the brush strokes that are going on. These are the, when I see the pictures of the artists uh, uh, ornamenting these, they're using brushes that are finer than makeup right, brushes. Right. They're tiny, tiny little like brushes. Like an eyeliner brush. Uh, it's like an it eyeliner, yeah. exactly right. So beautiful craftsmanship there in that clover egg as well. I love. Now the, the um, Romanoff egg is really, if you come in close, you'll see that it's actually shimmering from the inside. There's a beautiful kind of, it looks like black enamel, which would be en plein, which would be the, the French for all over. And it's actually shimmering from inside. You're seeing granulation, mm. like beautiful mill grain in the swirls. I love that ruby center of every flower. That's spectacular. Amazing. I love the band that goes around the, the side. And by the way, as I said, all over, there's no front and back. No. They're just extraordinary. You know, remember the movie Anastasia that's now a Broadway oh, show? Oh, of course. It's a Broadway musical and now. And the grandmother gave the beautiful, what a beautiful gift from grandmother to granddaughter. Oh, how amazing. Right? Absolutely. Now, this particular design, it's, it's known in certain uh, books when you look, do your Fabergé as the Chanticleer egg. Because if you look, it's a pair of roosters. And that's French for, for a rooster, of course, is Chanticleer. So while it's in the Pan-Slavic style, it's still, and it's sort of a mercury glass yeah. almost, which is quite beautiful. And when I look at the brush strokes and I see the fineness of the detail, I'm blown away that we can make that kind of quality. I, and I, I, I think it's extraordinary. I love what people have said about your eggs in the past. They're more beautiful in person. I mean, 100%. They're yep. four inches. They're not tiny. They come in the signature Joan Rivers box. Amazing. I love you getting a set for you and then another set to gift. I mean, because, I mean, when you think about Hallmark 2017, we have four special people in our lives. And maybe beautiful. It, it's a pick me up to give them. And you know what? They're so pretty. Leave them out year round. Get oh, I hear from a lot of women stand. that do that. Do put leave the stands out. and leave right. them in their vitrine or with their sort of framed pictures. And maybe if you're gifting, go to JoanRivers.com, print out my little write up of yes. all the eggs and then maybe you give the story as well as the eggs idea. which would be really lovely to not only have the beauty but then also the really where it's coming from in the history I think they're amazing and I couldn't be lover, prouder I oh. mean this is $14.73 and, and, and and that's and amazing fewer than 1700 sets they're just beautiful. for the entire 2017 season that's all we have and people are looking for these they're clamoring for these they're finally back in all brand new for 2017, but there are only 1,700 yeah. lucky people. For the year. For the year. Ah. Not coming back. But the best news is my favorite all-time Joan Rivers necklace. I will not admit how many ah. colors I have. Jane favorite things. Ah. Thursday night, David's going to be in it. Oh, and it's gorgeous. And I believe we're debuting a new color. <gasps> I hope I didn't spill the beans. Oh, and I might be wearing one Thursday. of my favorite colors on Sunday night. Yay. All in. right. I love you, honey. Good, love you too. I'll see you all tomorrow morning. I've got Dan Hughes. I've got David Venable. I've got lots of fun stuff tomorrow. Cool. See Wonderful. you there. Wonderful. All right. Stay with us, guys. And then talk about the whimsy of yesterday. Mr. Christmas has an animated tree topper. So it's Santa. Can you imagine what little Gus would do about this? Oh, my gosh. It is a, I, I mean, adorable. really? Ah. I just paint his nose red to be a real Rudolph in my family. <laughs> um, but here comes Rick Domeyer to keep us going. Christmas in July on sale. Uh, we do indeed. And I'll tell you something. When it comes to our Christmas in July special, I am world's worst gift wrapper. So all, how many times have I gone to, to the convenience store, to the pharmacy place, and gotten a bag like this one and paid $3 for this bag and $3 for that bag? And well, I could spend $21 in just a few bags. But for $19 and change, take a look at what you're getting. More bags, bigger bags, huge bags from our number one brand. It's our today's special value. That's the good news. The bad news is it's the final look. It's coming up now. As 143,000 people 143,000 orders have been placed. That would be times 17.